Today we will learn about all from 9, last from 10. This is a very basic concept and we will be using it quite frequently in our calculations. There are several scenarios and we are going to cover each one of them. The Vedic Sutra for all from 9, last from 10 is Nikhilam Navatash Charmam Dashataha. We will start with the basic concepts first. Base number. It is a number that starts with 1 and is followed by 0, for example 10, 100, 1000, 10,000 and so on. Multiple of base number is when any number is multiplied with the base number. For example, here we are multiplying 4 with base number 10. So 40 is the multiple of base number. Similarly, 600 is the multiple of base. In this concept, all from 9, last from 10, we will subtract any number from the base number or its multiple. For example, here we are subtracting 68 from base number 100 or 294 from 3000. Here we have to subtract 46 from 100. So we are going to start from right to left for the zeros. Write 10 on top of the last zero and then 9 for the next one. Next we will start subtracting. 10 minus 6 is 4. 9 minus 4 is 5. And for the digit which is next to the zero in this case 1, we will always subtract 1 from it. So 1 minus 1 is 0. So answer is 54. We have several scenarios. Let's say what if cases. We will solve each one of them. Here we have to subtract from multiple of base. So we will again start from right to left for the zeros. Write down 10 on top of the last one and 9 for the rest of the zeros. Let's start subtracting. 10 minus 4 is 6. 9 minus 2 is 7. 9 minus 1 is 8. And for the digit next to 0, which is 5, we will subtract 1 from it. So 5 minus 1 is 4. So our answer is 4876. Moving on to the next scenario, which is double digits. So here in the base number, we have two digits besides 0, 3 and 2. So let's see how we're going to solve this one. We will start from right to left. As usual, write down 10 on top of the last 0 and 9 for the rest of the zeros and start subtracting. 10 minus 2 is 8, 9 minus 0 is 9, 9 minus 3 is 6 and for 2 we are going to subtract 1 from it. So 2 minus 1 is 1. Now for 3 we are going to copy it as is. So our final answer is 31,698. Moving on to the next scenario which is lesser digits. So here in the base number we have three zeros but 57 has only two digits. So let's see how we will solve this one. We will start from right to left and write down our 10 and 9s and start subtracting. 10 minus 7 is 3, 9 minus 5 is 4. Since there is no digit here we are going to assume 0. So 9 minus 0 is 9 and we are going to subtract 1 from 6. 6 minus 1 is 5. Our final answer is 5,943. Next is unequal digits. So here in the base number we have two zeros but three digits in 316. To solve it we are going to start from right to left and write down 10 and 9 and subtract. 10 minus 6 is 4. 9 minus 1 is 8. Now per previous examples we have to subtract 1 from the digit next to 0, 5 in this case. So we will do exactly that. 5 minus 1 is 4. Now we are going to subtract 3 from this 4. So 4 minus 3 is 1. For the last digit 4 we are going to copy it as is and thus our answer will be 4184. Hopefully you are more comfortable with the concept by now. Let's check our progress in the practice quiz. I would like you to solve the following three questions on your own and then check the answer in the description box below. Feel free to pause the video per your convenience. The first question is what is 100 minus 67? Now you have these options. You can choose your answer from here. The next one is what is 2000 minus 781? You don't have to write 10 and 9 every single time. You can think about it mentally and try to solve it. And the last question is, what is 2700 minus 604? 
and here are your options. I would like to end the video with a quotation from Michael Jordan. Obstacles don't have to stop you. If you run into a wall, don't turn around and give up. Figure out how to climb it, go through it or work around it.